everybody and welcome back to the channel and welcome to day two of Stanley's recovery. Stanley, let's have a look at you. Are you oh, oh no, it was super zoomed in from the only face. Ah, should we do it again? Nah, I'll be fine. Hello. So we've just been out, so he's got his little pyjamas on because when we're in the house, we take his pyjamas off because he finds it really uncomfortable to sit down, as you can see. He looks very uncomfortable and I'm talking very fast because... Are we hyped, Chelsea? Yeah. We only, hyped. We only nicked hyped. out though. We didn't actually leave and we only No, we out. only went out for a little bit. So this was actually the first time he was ever out by himself. Like, by, 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 by himself. Because obviously there's no other dogs here. <gasps> we haven't told them. There's no other dogs here. Okay, we've got so much to tell them, Chelsea. You need to slow down, man. <gasps> so as you can see, we are preparing for self-isolation. <laughs> we are. Chelsea, we... Chelsea, coronavirus is no laughing matter. No, I'm looking at that. Have <laughs> <laughs> you found the food stand? Yes, as well. <laughs> straight up. Oh, oh. You got your foot stuck. Ready? One, two, three. Wee! Say hi to the people. Oh, you're doing very well, though, aren't you, Mister? You're doing very, very well. <laughs> so then, we have for the next three, four, three days. Three days, we have took Pablo and Stanley. Oh, no, no, no. Pablo, three, four. No. Last today and tomorrow, two days. Two days. Yeah. So last night, Chelsea took Pablo and Winston round to Chelsea's parents. So they're there. So today's Friday, so they'll be there. All of Friday, Saturday, Sunday, and we're picking up Sunday night. No, 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 no. Saturday night. No, yeah. So they'll be there all of Friday, all of Saturday. We're picking up Saturday night because Stanley's got the vets on Sunday morning, and so have they. They, they've all got the vets, right? So as you've seen from the first video, which will be out, uh, these might be a little bit delayed, but Stanley and Winston together are just inseparable. Uh, yeah, you. It's so hard to keep them from stopping fighting and all things. I mean, you've seen it from that video we were struggling. I mean, that was constant. The amount of times Winston had to be put in the kitchen and locked, but then they both cry at the fence to get each other in. It's like, oh my God, please stop. So we decided we were going to just put Winston basically away from Stanley just for a few days until Stanley, you know, recovers properly. Because if Winston sees his cup, Winston's like, I need to lick it. So that means you have to put the Medi shirt on, which when we put the Medi shirt on, Stanley doesn't like it and he gets all agitated and then he's agitated, which means Winston's agitated, which means the fight and run and jump about. Now we didn't know what to do with Pablo. We were like, do we keep him here and have him chill or do we take him with Winston? Now Winston's a very social dog, so we sent him with Pablo. We sent Pablo with Winston because socially together, Winston probably won't cope on his own. I think if we left Pablo here, I think Stanley would then be trying to bother Pablo to play because there's someone here. So we just wanted Stanley by himself so he can just chill and just be nice and plus if Pablo's got the opportunity to go around to Chelsea's parents house he is taking it he, he didn't even want to come home when Chelsea took them around so you probably won't want to come home in a few days but tonight we're going to go around and see them because obviously we don't want to separate them for too long we know we don't want to just like where the hell are each other we'll still visit them we need to get some bits of bobs but <sighs> take a breath right we aren't actually stockpiling but we did both need a big shop because we didn't have much left in the cupboards and because everybody is stockpiling it's really hard to get stuff so we are it's essentially insane. The stockpiling. things that are running out are like toilet, toilet paper, roll, but, yeah. pasta and paracetamol. Like we have enough toilet roll to last us like another week and a half maybe two weeks but we're like what if we can't get any more in that time so we've had to go buy some so it's just my but advice to you wonderful people, you people watching these videos is, mm -hmm. yes, you need to stockpile for mm -hmm. yourself, but don't forget, you also have dogs. If you have dogs, you have dogs. Stockpile their food as well, because if we get trapped in the house, yeah, we've got food and toilet paper and everything else, but they also need food. So make sure you get plenty of food in case anything does happen with this whole coronavirus thing. You know, make sure they've got plenty of food as well, plenty of treats, you know, stock up on poo bags so your garden doesn't get full, everything like this. Stock up for your dogs, dogs priority, and then go get yourself everything else. Right, this video is about you. That's that was a long winded. Hi, yeah. So so far he has been absolutely fantastic, and this has given us serious flashbacks to when we just had Pablo and he was neutered, and we only have one dog, which is really weird. Only having one dog now, but like since moving them two away, he has been apart from now because we've only just came in he's quite hyper he's been super chill he's just been lying on the bed with us snuggling in sleeping let's get more 
Very like it's nice going back down to one and kind of like there's like we took him to town earlier on just for a little walk about he's only allowed little walk so we were shopping in town so we thought we'll take him with us and like it's so much easier with just one dog and it, like yeah but like at the same time exactly what Chelsea just said I'm like I want another one where's my other one I want like another one to play with when he doesn't want to play I think it's nice having one on one time it's not yeah. nice having one dog but Stanley has got some tablets to take so what are we going to do Chelsea do you want some chucky eggs? Chucky eggs. Scrambled egg. Scrambled eggs for everyone else. Does anybody else call them chucky eggs? My family never did. Rah, rah, rah. I've got some tablets for you, my babies. Do some tablets. Do <gasps> some tablets. With our stockpiled eggs, I'll let you have some for chucky eggs. Go see then. She's gonna get you some. She's gonna get you some dinner. Do some breakfast. Dinner. Breakfast. Food. Go on in. Yay. Stan, have you had chucky egg before? Never. Never? <gasps> what a treat this is going to be. Take his pyjamas off. Wait, I'm just I want a necky bug. I want a necky no, necky bug. Just on the whole corona thing though, because I mean it's a hot topic of conversation, I think everyone is very aware of what's going on. Um, I'm not worried about this at all, for myself. So. But yeah, for you guys, dog. as far as I'm aware, dogs can't get it. It's not a thing they can contract, but it does live in hair and stuff, so that means dogs can carry it. So what I would say to everyone is like an early sort of bit of advice is if you're taking them for walks and stuff, maybe just don't let other people touch them. Just kind of take them on your walks, get them home, and maybe avoid taking them to like town and things like that. Take them in more rural places where that does it, like where basically the disease can't live very well. Says the person that just took their dog to town. <laughs> says, says the people that just took the dog to town, but I'm, I'm giving advice to you, do as I say, not as I do. Is that what they're saying? Yeah. Oh! Uh -huh. Hey! Do not judge me. Do not do, judge do me. Not, do not judge me. Yeah, uh, you... Round, something about round jokes? I don't know. Chucky egg! Okay, Chelsea. Tutorial, how to make chucky egg. With what? Chelsea Norris. Come in! Come in! Oh, <laughs> so is that, that's an egg. That's an egg. Yeah. So these Medi shirts are great as well because you literally just pop. Why do you shirt? And pop because there's more the dogs. So then you do put some milk in. Splash your milk. Microwave. Oh, it's a good chucky egg. Yeah. Also, if anybody on the channel wants to give me a hand, I keep having this recurring dream that my teeth are wobbly and they fall out. What does that mean? Chelsea is ready! It's not ready. It's ready. It's ready, fella. It looks ready. Oh no! That looks great. Yeah. All we need to do is just leave that for a couple of minutes to cool down because that'll be red hot right now. Leave that for a couple of minutes. And the power of editing, da -la 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 -la. While we wait for this egg to cool down, can I just clarify as well, do not use any kind of antibacterial, any kind of sanitizers, anything like that on your dogs. Like, oh, no. you need to wash them water and soap as you normally would. Do not use anything like this because it will burn their skin. It will cause so many issues. Wash them completely as you would normally with soap and water. Don't use anything like this. And shampoo. I get asked. Yeah, you'd be amazed that people are probably already doing that. So just as a word of like, please don't, because you're gonna, you might cause them, you might cause them harm. We don't want harm to any doggies, do we? No. And it's cool. In his bowl. Yeah. I want to put his tablet in with his, with his chucky egg. <laughs> That's why he's getting a chucky egg. No, he's getting chucky egg because he's a good boy. Go on then. Everyone loves ASMR. Oh, he's good finished! Boy. Good boy! Thank you! Was that nice? No. Oh, you've got it in your ears and everything. Good boy! Oh, was that nice? Did he eat it? He eat it. Did he eat it? Did you do the eating? Have you done the eating? Have you? 
Oh. We're gonna pop all this stuff away and if he does anything cute in the meantime, hello, we'll catch back up with you. If not, we will catch back up with you later when we go see Pablo and Winston and they get a little bit of a reuniting. All right, yeah? Hello. Chelsea, me and Stanley are just going to go into the cellar. Ta-da, Chelsea, ta-da. Ta-da, ta-da. Ta-da, all done. Oh my goodness. Going to go see your brothers. Hey, yeah. Going to go see your brothers, have some plays. And you're going to wear your pyjamas again. So, so Winston doesn't bite you. Because <laughs> um, it'll be sore. You're excited. Isn't he such a chill puppet now when he's not here? He's just relaxed and chilling, and sleeping. Is that man? Go. Hello! <laughs> Hello! Whoa! Whoa! Oh, little guy! Did you know it was me? <laughs> hey! Hey, sweetheart. <laughs> Oh. Who's that? Who's that? So we said we're going home. You coming, Pablo? You coming home, Winston? He's coming home. No, you staying here. Okay, well, we'll, we'll just go without you. Bye. Bye. Like Alright, fine. We we'll go with all this. Probably you can have another night. You can have another night. What that means practically is to stay about two metres or three that's steps away from anyone else that you live with. with. Yeah. So that might mean that is so relaxed. So Pablo and Winston don't want to come home, but Stan here, he's now down for the night. He's going to be sleeping all night. So we'll end the video here. Hope you guys are enjoying. And We'll be a couple more of these, and then we'll be back to making normal-ish videos. I guess you'll see ya? Yeah. Yeah. So, we'll see you guys tomorrow. We are going to be picking Pablo and Winston back up. I can't get the names right today. There's too many names to remember. We'll be picking them back up tomorrow and bringing them home in the night, so you'll be reunited, so you're going to have another day of kind of chills, and we'll pick them up. Like, comment, subscribe as always, people. Peace out. <laughs> what, Chelsea? Peace out. Peace out.